United States. Now, away from that, the federal government has promised to provide an enabling platform for effective policies for the diaspora. This was part of the speech of President Bola Tinubu at the commemoration of the National Diaspora Day in Abuja. Amoyo Thomas reports. The current foreign remittance of Nigerians and diaspora is now about $21 billion, four times the foreign direct investment received in 2022. This is one of the reasons Nigerians and diaspora deserve the recognition and acknowledgement the National Diaspora Day is set aside to achieve. The NIDCOM chairman says there are opportunities to harness more for national development if the Diaspora Investment Fund could be established. The rich academic, professional, global exposure and various contemporary experiences have already placed our diaspora at an advantage. I'm therefore enthusiastically waiting to have you empty yourselves intellectually and generously to, en to enrich the delivery of our mandate for the development of our dear nation, Nigeria. May I also let you know that this new uh, democratically elected government is a diaspora-friendly one, which will provide an enabling platform for effective policies for the diaspora with a view to galvanizing support for the new administration and concretizing our democracy, setting an ex excellent example for other African countries to follow. One of the highlights of the commemoration is a special rendition by the 10-year-old granddaughter of the legend Christy Igokwe and the cutting of the cake. <laughs> Guests went round the exhibition stand to know more about opportunities in the country. It means a lot to us. The excitement of Nigerians in diaspora could not be contained. I've got kids who are watching right now who are so excited that they, despite the fact that they've not been in Nigeria, but they are being celebrated in Nigeria. So it's kind of a big deal for us. We love it. And we hope that um, as it progresses, we'll begin to bring our younger generations home to come to, the, to come to our homeland. So it's a special day that we have a government who recognizes the fact that there are Nigerians in the diaspora that are doing excellently well, and then to also find a way and then a recognition for them to have a sit down with them. So it is important uh, that we have that. This is a critical time for Nigeria to ensure it gets contributions from all sectors and segments of its citizens to achieve the national development it truly desires. Moya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.